Hi everyone, this is the gas walkthrough for July 22nd. I'm Philip Newman. Today I'm solving Even More Forever by Bill Murphy. This is an even and XV pairs Sudoku. So we have normal Sudoku rules, one to nine in each row, column, and three by three box. We have some gray squares in the grid. Digits in the gray squares must be even. And then we have some X's and V's. If there is a V between two cells, those digits sum to five. And if there's an X, those sum to 10. And there may be other pairs of digits. For example, these might sum to 10 or five. And those are the rules. And I am gonna color uh, today. So we'll use blue for even. And color all the even cells. Now, this cell, has a sum of 10 with this even digit. Since 10 is also even, this has to be even. And the same is true here. Now this is connected to this cell by a V. These sum to something odd, so this has to be odd. And then these sum to something even, this also has to be odd. So these will also be odd. And that's gonna give us some information in this box. We've used all of our odd digits, I guess I can do the given digits real quick. Um, so these have to be even. And now we have these on this side, so all of these have to be odd. These x's as well, we already have three even digits in the box, same is true down here. So this can't be an even plus an even, these all have to be odd. And that may be as far as we go with that for now. So if it's on a V and it's even, it's two or four with one or three as the odd digit. And then this has to be high. This has to be high, six or eight. And we can do the same down here, two or four, one or three, seven or nine, six or eight. These are also two or four because they're on Vs, these are one, three, and these are seven, nine. It's gonna give us some pairs, so seven, nine pair here. Uh, we have a two, four pair in the column, so this has to be six or eight, same here. And let's look at our given digits now. So the eight tells us this is six, this is four, this is one, this is nine, this is seven, this is three, this is two, this is four, six, eight, seven, three, and then nine and one. This is two, and then eight here, and also an eight here because of the six, and this is a six because of the eight. Now we have all but four as our even digits in this row, two in this row. This is either two or six, this is four or eight. Right, uh, we still need our even digits in this row, six and eight. These are gonna be seven and nine, but we have a seven here and a nine over here. These are both odd. Since we have a nine here, we know this is not one nine. So this is three, seven, this is one nine. And our remaining digits are four, five, and eight. And here we have a seven, so this is not three, seven. This is one, nine. In that order, a little bit of a symmetry break here. Um, the nine can't go here, so it goes here with the one. This is three, seven. These are two, five, six. Okay, nine in this box. We've got nines here, 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 and also in one of these cells, so this has to be nine. Um, this X also can't be three, seven because of the three, seven over here. There wouldn't be anything left um, for this cell. We put three, seven here. It also can't be four, six, so it has to be two, eight in this order because of the eight. That's gonna give us six and eight. The two here, this makes us six, five, and two. Color that one blue. This has to be four because that's our last even digit. And then six in this box 
Can't go in these columns. Can't go here, so it must go here. And these are all odd. And this is odd. And these are odd. So we have all of the even digits. Uh, this is 3 or 7 because it sees 1 and 9 in the column, 5 in the box. And that's important because of this x. This x now can't be 1, 9 or 3, 7 or 2, 8. So it is 4, 6. And we know the order from this 4. The 2 is going to have to go here somewhere. I don't know if we can resolve that yet. Uh, 6 here can't go in these cells, so it must go here. This is 4, 8. Uh, but the 8 can't go in these cells because of these 8, so this is 8. Uh, the 4 looks over and gives us 8, 5, 4. Two is the last even in this row. And we still need an eight in this box. It's got to go there. So that's odd. These are all odd. Uh, four can't go here. So in the column, it has to go here. That's odd. This can't be two, so one of these is. So that means this is odd. And it's not 3 or 1, 7, 9, so it's 5. This is not 3, 7, or 5, so it's 1 or 9. Uh, these are 1, 3, and we have a 1 there. These are 5 and 7. Know the order. Uh, 1 has to go here because of this 1, and then this can't be 5, so it is 7 and 5. That results 3 and 7 over here. I have 1, 3, and 4. 3 and 4 in this column, and then 3 in this column. That's part of the 3, 7 pair. So those are resolved. This is odd, um, and it has to be 1. That's the only thing it can be. These are even in the row. There are two and four in that order. This is odd. That's a five. These are two and three. We know the order from that three. The results are twos. And we have finished coloring. Um, this is one or nine, but actually I'm seeing the one here. So this is nine, one in this order. These are three, five, and seven. That one's not five, and that one's not five. Up here we have a 3, 7 pair, so this cell is 1 or 9, but again we have a 1, so 1, 9, 1, could have also resulted from that. This is 3 or 7, and now the 3 here looks up, so 7, 3, 7, 3, 7, and 3. That's the solution. So let us know how you did with that in the comments, um, I really enjoyed that. Uh, I think when I solved this originally I didn't fully color, um, the coloring helps a lot, which is a little slower. Um, but be curious if anybody solved it without coloring um, or with partial coloring. Just let us know what your experience was, and I will see you next time.